Dear Diary, everyone has that voice inside their head, right? Mine is future me. Growing up is so hard. Together, we're tackling seventh grade. Something's wrong with Melissa's arm. I think she's waving. Apparently, over the summer, everything changed. And my BFF had a new BF. Wait, what? So much has happened in the past 15 hours. And now we're holding hands. Things are moving so fast. Oh, no. Can you get out of my head? I'm busy. Seventh grade wasn't exactly going according to plan. And lastly, tree number two, Elena Canetta Reed. And it wasn't just school where things were different. We have some really big news. Sam is moving in. I listened to my heart. Who do I think I am? Rose from Titanic? Look what she ended up. In possession of a priceless jewel? Living to be 101? Being drawn by P. Cleo? Bobby had a lot on his plate, too. You had a crush and never said anything? Who is she? I don't know if I'm ready to tell anyone yet. Diary, this year was off to a rough start. I'm used to knowing everything. You're not alone anymore. There's about to be another whole adult in the house. Hey, check this out. Sort of. I had such high expectations for this year. Now I feel so lost. Bit by bit, she's pushing me away. You're not growing apart. She's just growing up. I'm their mother. I'm supposed to help them solve their problems, not give them problems. Have you met a Latina mother? I'm trying to break the cycle. Don't shut out the people who are eager to lift you up. You're more annoying than my mom. You and I are the same person. Being there for you is kind of my job. Being there for others and lifting them up. That's what I want to do. I'm ready. Diary of a Future President. All episodes streaming August 18th. You again? I'm having a moment. I am you. This is your voice. I don't remember sounding this shrill. <gasps> I'm sorry. That was uncalled for. Why, Why are, are men, men never, never called shrill? shrill? Only on Disney Plus. Your TV mom, Selenis, who plays Gabby, yes. like not that long ago. And this, I was talking to her about how this show like means a lot to so many people. It is so family. It's one of those things that you can watch with an entire family. It's inspiring. And now you guys have season two, which we are all excited about. And a lot is going on for Elena in her family life, at school. And just talk to us about where you pick up in season two and what people can expect without giving away too much, though. Okay. Um, yeah, so, you know, like I said, Elena's going to run for student rep and she's you know, she's all excited. Um, and then in the first few episodes, we get to see her, like a lot of changes are happening in her life, um, in her home life and in her school life. So, you know, she's dealing with a lot of new things. So in season two, you're gonna get to see her kind of grapple with that. You're gonna see her grow older, learn, learn a few things, and you get to see her relationships shift and all the family dynamics change. It's, very exciting. All right, so what's even ex super exciting for us, aside from the fact that this is an amazing show, is that our family member, CW family member Gina Rodriguez, is involved, because you played the younger version of her. And I also know that she already directed like one of the episodes from last season, didn't she? So how's that relationship like, having to work with her? Um, it was great. It was real. she's such a good, she's so sweet and supportive and loving, and she always wants to make sure everybody's comfortable. Um, she's just been really great to me. I'm so happy because we actually got to film real scenes together this season. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, it's been really amazing. Um, we got to have a lot of fun on set, and she just brings such a warm, loving energy to set. So it's, it's been pretty great. Um, right. Everything with Jamie has been fun. Speaking of warm, loving I wanted to start by talking about some of the parallels between Elena as a character and also your own background in acting, because I think there's a lot of similar tenacity and ambition and drive that you have to have in everything that you're doing, you know, putting yourself forward for auditions all the time and going out for roles. And then once you land the job, there's so many complicated elements that come with it. And that's the journey that we see her on as a character as well. And so did you find that this was a character that you were able to really bring a lot of your own experience in the industry towards and a lot of aspects of yourself yeah I mean I never really thought of it that way but like now that you put it like that I definitely can see sort of the parallels of you know being an actor and just like constantly audition after audition and then like once you get it like you said just you know there's a lot of work and there's a lot of determination that you need and Elena is definitely a very determined gal so I definitely admire that um playing her, realizing like all that like passion and strength that she has. I try to incorporate that into my own life 
um, you know, just like as a human being and as an actor. So yeah, I can connect with her on that level. Um, and I sort of envy her, um, just her determination. She's very driven and I, I try. <laughs> Six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, 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 six, seven, eight, one